Ah, kia ora koutou. <clears throat> well, you've heard it all before. In submissions to the City Council and Regenerate Christchurch, always overwhelming support, though, for all of these ideas over decades of public lectures, NGO involvement. So how do I make a difference for all of us, honour that support, um, and does my knowledge, experience, civil and royal awards make any difference? <laughs> um, where's the... Right, OK. So the silent majority came out of their shell a decade ago uh, with share and idea and council analysis of that. I promoted solutions to all of these uh, concepts for decades, but sometimes wonder, is there any actual sound coming out of my mouth? Ah, busy people uh, want to help. <clears throat> they need regular inclusive forums, conversations inside the tent, not endless submissions that waste everyone's time with no known outcome. There are good positive examples, of course, um, of uh, kind of a joint um, um, meetings with, with, uh, with uh, citizens and, and council, and we need more of that now. <clears throat> Here are some of my community-tested propositions related to share and ideas, keywords. Green and gold, um, eco sanctuary constellations, golden winters, Kotamako Capital, Christchurch 360 Trail showcasing our heritage, dollars from slow ecotourism, all leading to a distinctive city that ticks the boxes for first national park city in Aotearoa, New Zealand. Please, can we get on and do it? <clears throat> Award winning pocket park, a concept that was promoted by the council. Um, I presume the planners and the art and landscape architects and the council know of this. <clears throat> Green Cathedral Square, one multi-layered history, our multi-layered history with a little bit of help from Lincoln University and, and some of the graphics. We sent this to regenerate Christchurch and to city managers and reports, but not a peep. The Avon River, weaving the worlds of Teteriti. Our anchor project team designed this for the inner city Otakaro, then was rejected by an overseas hydrologist who didn't know that bridges, not trees, dammed the river. But there was no correction because no, there was no ecologist in the room. Another lost opportunity. People and walkways, dancing, fusion concerts in the park, sculpture and art, Christchurch 360 trail pilgrimage. People say it's better than the El Camino and great walks. It reinforces my sense of place in Turanga Waiwai. It's a whole thing I didn't know we had. Participants have written songs, made videos and plaques and T-shirts. I've never worn this open jacket before. There's the T-shirt, by the way. <laughs> Slightly embarrassing. Anyway, <laughs> we also need to provide leadership in checking the asteroids and co-designing creative transitions through sustainable futures uh, to be precautionary and innovative. Again, the people diversity and aroha. We can never be complacent. Imagine an elevated plain table pointing to and embracing our natural, cultural and spiritual diversity, all standing together. So what am I seeking? I'm seeking your support and working together to engage the citizens of Ototahi and build the energy around these initiatives. <clears throat> You have advisory groups for budgeting and marketing and other things, but you need also for quadruple bottom line, the eco ecological input. We tried this with a biodiversity advisory group, but it got smashed down. We need to do this through citizen assemblies and think tanks, open to anyone and all. The time is now. No time, uh, there's no time to waste. And I want to thank uh, Phil um, and... Uh, uh, Clive Appleton and Tony Moore and Shelley Walsh, uh, Washington and John Skilton for the Travers Partnership for the great models that have already been um, established for this kind of citizen assembly. Uh, but we now let we now let me go. Want you to go further and work with you, Tony um, Moore, um, etc., Iwi, and best brains in the social enterprise from my extensive all age university and Crown Research networks and build on these initiatives. I'm asking for a nod from you to engage with key staff to capture this latent hope and enthusiasm to make our place something else, something other than the Uncle Barry image, uh, the boring flat city and people, um, with conversations inside the tent that promises awesome, affirming, inclusive, future-proofed outcomes at no real extra cost. We can do this. Not just being patted on the head and see you next year until you drop dead. 
uh, seem to sort of experience that a little bit. Uh, not dropping dead yet, hopefully. Um, many things for citizens to support council and iwi, um, and building a case for a fairer, um, uh, fairer um, uh, treatment of the super south. We need to take our cause to central government, bring together the um, um, you know the the councils and iwi from throughout uh, um, um, Te Waiponamu. We have the brand. We have Sky Song City. I hope you saw the inspiring Northwest Arch yesterday. Let's go out, inspire, celebrate, lead, and be a model to Aotearoa, indeed the world. With more people coming to University of Canterbury now, we need to really go for it. We can really build on this, and I think we need to be an attractive place for people to come to. Thank you. Kia ora. Thank you very much, Colin. That was that, that was very good. Thanks for coming up. <laughs> very pictorial. A little frustration. <laughs> no, but, it's good. Uh... <laughs> it's good. Thank you. So we've run out of time for questions, I'm sorry. Really? Yes. Did that, how, long, how long did I take? 25 minutes. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. It's uh, a couple of minutes over, but that's all right. But thanks. Well, thanks I hope I can get that nod. I want to kind of really build on that um, those partnerships, and I believe I've got some skills and knowledge and networks to help do that. I want to support the city. I'm passionate about our place and it being better than it is. Kia ora. Okay. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. Okay, next we have... The Big Street Bikers. Cleave here, please. Welcome. <laughs>